train ticket. A single ticket with no visible destination was covered in Dr. Schrader's home. It appears to be for the Military Express, but where exactly is it supposed to take his owner? Okay, so I just want to point something out. Uh, Layden and Luke said, like, you know, they witnessed the death of the Elysian Box firsthand. Technically, they didn't. All they really did was found him laying on the floor. So, for all they know, he could just he could just be taking a nap or something. Yeah. <laughs> so, who's on the chat, by the way? Because I, because I... Oh, Luke is back. Oh, dear. Not this asshole. Oh yeah, uh, oh yeah, uh, oh yeah, Star. Um, there is um, we won't we won't be getting to this uh, puzzle in uh, uh, we won't be uh, we won't be getting to the puzzle uh, the train ticket puzzle in uh, this section. Uh, but next section there is a little fun fact with that uh, train ticket that I will uh, mention soon. And yeah, this is a nice little continuity. The car doesn't care. <laughs> Oh my God. Like, oh, I, I, I like this. this. This is real funny. He's the real deal. You know what in the blazes? That's my face, not some piece of taffy. I'm so sorry, sir. I didn't mean it. I was sure we had another imposter on our hands. What in the world is this child talking about? I swear, young ones these days have no manners. My apologies for the confusion. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Herschel Layton. I'm a professor of archaeology at Gresson Heller University. And I'm his apprentice, Luke. Interesting. So if I understand correctly, you keep a child around as an apprentice, do you? Not at all, sir. In truth, he's... Professor Layton's apprentice, like I said. Well, it's really none of my concern. I have a crime scene that needs my attention. Clear a path, will you? But of course. Luke, not a word about that ticket to the authorities, all right? You got it, Professor. Well, I get it reported to the authorities right now, run right away. Let's see. Well, <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, I mean, to be fair, this is, you know, this is one of those universes where, I mean, to be fair, Gemli is not really... It's not really stupid or not really dumb and such. He's just one of those that sometimes can be, you know, um, oh, thank, oh, thank you for subbing, Star. Uh, anyway, yeah, he's not really uh, stupid or brain dead or anything like that, but he can be, you know, uh, a little full of himself sometimes. Inspector, uh, but, uh, but, uh, but I do like him as a character. He's a good character. I came in. Uh, I'm gonna verify the, so the, this the, 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 then the doctor was holed up in here, completely apart from the outside world, yes? That being the case, hmm, yes, I'm sure of it. The old gent must have suffered a heart attack. What? How did you come to that conclusion, sir? Ardeon. Yes, oh, welcome, Ardeon. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, uh, 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 yeah. This is the first game where it actually did mention uh, uh, the professor being an archaeology. Uh, but, uh, like, uh, like, uh, like, he, uh, like, he's not just, you know, having the professor as an actual title. He is an actual professor at a university. Although, the only time where you can actually uh, see him uh, teach a class is in the uh, movie Professor Layton and the um, Eternal Diva. There's something quite unusual about our crime scene that's been overlooked. Eh? It's as plain as the nose on your face, Inspector. <laughs> I suppose you academics think your fancy degrees prepare you to play detective, eh? I tell you, nowadays, it seems like everybody and their mum thinks they can do my job. Oh, tell me, just you, you haven't been on Reddit or Twitter in a while. And that shows us why it's dangerous. Now, as I was saying, the cause of death was heart failure, plain and simple. And there's what caused it. Dinosaur. This, it's a scaled down model of a Kronosaurus, if I'm not mistaken. Hold on a second, dude. I'm gonna help my dad with something. Uh, okay, that's fine. The old fellow oh. turned on the light, took one look at the beast, and then killed right over. This is the doctor's own home. Why would the bones he oh, I, uh, I, have, uh, I haven't seen the, uh, either the movie or the anime yet. Um, I want to uh, I want to finish the uh, Professor Layton prequel trilogies first before I take a look at any of those um, 
to uh, uh, before I take a look at any of those two menias. Although I am a little excited to uh, see the, um, uh, I am a little excited to see the Professor Layton movie because I heard it's one of the few uh, video game movies that is actually real good. The scenario you paint certainly isn't out of the realm of possibility, but considering the lights were off when we entered the room, I don't think we found our answer yet. Oh, uh, really? Furthermore, look around you, Inspector. Doesn't anything strike you as odd? What do you mean, Professor? Study your surroundings, Luke. I'm sure you can see it, too. Alright, I don't know if Toy Barney is still here, so if not, I'll do the puzzle myself. Uh, but basically, in this puzzle, um, you have, a, so something is very strange in this room, and you basically have to move around and circle that one odd thing that is strange. So, you can move around in basically four locations, and whatever you see, uh, just basically circle, so nothing strange here, or here, but we can see the professor's back, uh, or here. Oh, but there is something strange right there. Fuck you, that's a good circle. <laughs> Just leave it to me. I heard that. Uh, give me a second. <laughs> that was almost too easy. Of course. This window is missing a curtain. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So it is. But what exactly does this have to do with... Uh, sorry, uh, sorry about that. Uh, I mean, it's, it's probably gonna happen where I'm accidentally gonna skip dialogue and such. But again, if you want to see some of the dialogue, um, do uh, do watch my walkthrough and such. Oh, well, hopefully I'll try not to do it too much. Well done, my boy. Oh, yes. Sound as a pound. I was just about to propose the same idea myself. Liar. Well, actually, uh, uh, here's a fun fact I heard about the uh, Professor Layton movies. Uh, originally, they were supposed to do a movie in between each of the uh, prequel games and such. Uh, but it turns out that uh, Eternal Diva was the only movie they made and such. I don't know the exact reasons why they didn't make the other two movies. Either because like they didn't have enough budget, or maybe or maybe the first one didn't do that hot or something. But uh, but that's what I heard. It's an old photograph, but it's been torn into so many pieces. I can't make out the original image. <laughs> Alrighty. Torn photo. Torn fragments of a photograph were found in the late doctor's hand. In its current state, it's impossible to make out the contents of the photo. What could it be dis depicting? Hey, what's the big idea? You can't just pour evidence in a crime scene. Get your hands off that. Hmm. Uh, that. Uh, what is this anyway? Hmm. Not <laughs> I'll be holding on to that. Now, out with the All right. Alright, well. Okay, we don't have the photo anymore. Ah, but we're not done! Look you, yes you are done. Now get out! Dr. Schrader indicated that he was in possession of the Elysian box. Yet, there was nothing resembling such an artifact in his home. You think the person who did it to, to him was after the bomb? That's an interesting theory, but for the moment, that's all it is. However, it's my belief that we hold a clue to understanding today's event, namely that ticket. The moment from his first ticket, right, Professor? Correct, Luke. I believe that a trip aboard the Military Express is in order. And thus, that's why we're on the Military Express now. Somebody managed to steal the Elysian box from Dr. Schrader's home without without leaving behind a single in, implic, implicating clue. Who could have made off with the box? Alright. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Did you suspect we'll find the key to unlocking this mystery on the train? Dr. Schrader did his best to point us towards the Military Express should something happen to him. Sure as fog on a London morning, I know this train will lead us to the answers we seek. Professor Layton and Luke sped away from the city, unaware of the secrets that awaited them down those iron tracks. 
The island of Sodor is surrounded by beautiful blue sea. Oh, that's uh, oh, that, oh, that's fine, Star. Uh, if you do, uh, if you do, uh, if you, <laughs> uh, if you do need to go to sleep and such, uh, do uh, do go to uh, uh, do go to sleep if you need to. Like, you know, uh, we uh, we understand and such. At least, uh, at least, thank you for joining the uh, stream and checking us out anyway, and thank you for subscribing. And uh, and I do hope you do feel better soon. All right, so we've been playing for 32 minutes. Sounds about right. All right, chapter one, a legendary on the military, well, oh, legendary right. military I hope, express. I hope you get well, Star. Yep. Hope you get well. Mm -hmm. Be well. Yes, we all hope you get, you, we all hope you be well soon. Gosh, just look at that place, Professor. It's so posh, I feel like I should be wearing a monocle. <laughs> Quite so. Every decoration and detail in this room is dedicated and the loss. I wager the rest of the train is just as grand. How would you like to go exploring for a bit? We just lost Justin over there. He's a little bit more interested in Among Us than us now. No. What? Yeah, yeah kind of. <laughs> we we kind of we kinda, we kinda know how you feel about Professor Layton, so it's it's okay. No, I do like trains. Though. That was hilarious. That right, was then, hilarious. Join, then join us. Yeah. No, I am no, coming. No, don't, 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 don't. Anyway, all right, let's see if we can find it. Okay, Look at that, Luke. Your back is wide open and your belongings are scattered everywhere. Uh, sorry, yeah, I, guess <laughs> I, I accidentally clicked. All right, all right, you're very, you're very welcome, Star. So, so, uh, so again, if you do, if you do need to rest up and take care of yourself, please do. And we hope, and we hope to see you again. Uh, uh, if you're still here, um, I guess we'll make the announcement right now. Next Friday. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're doing it Friday because uh, next Saturday I'm gonna be uh, out of town and such. So if both uh, Justin and Toy Bonnie are able to make it uh, next Friday. The uh, next stream will be next Friday, probably around four or five and such. So look out for the announcement on that one. Anyway, you should put your things away before we walk around the train. All right, Luke's trunk. Alrighty. So basically, Luke's belongings are all over the place. Uh, what you need to do is put all the uh, all of his belongings in a trunk and make sure none of them uh, overlap and such. No. Want to try this? Yeah, I'll try it. Okay, go ahead. All right. So basically, it's just basically uh, one of those you know click and drag the items and such. I'll, I'll adjust him to this one. You know, since he's got... <laughs> Join the Professor Lane fan club. Tie him to the chair and make him. And make him solve the puzzles. I think uh, I think she's more referring to you. Yeah, she probably is. Why? Uh, those are already oh there. You're overlapping them. Well, that's well, that's also because uh, you can no, also no. move them too. You can you can move both the harmonica and the uh, telescope. You can. Yeah, okay. you can. Yeah. I was wondering. Yeah. Okay. That definitely goes here. And then I believe. Yeah, so, so, yeah sorry, I, sorry if I'm also not getting involved. It's just I'm, I'm texting and I'm also watching the stream at the same time. That's why. That's, uh, that, uh, that's fine. Okay, that definitely goes there. There it goes down there. Alright, you're getting there. Goes there. Uh huh. Yeah, goes there. Almost. I was close. No, uh, you're, you're, you're right on the money. You're right no, on the money. because... Oh, there you go. There you go. Hey, nice job. First try. <laughs> tie me to a chair. What? <laughs> tie, uh, tie, basically, tie him to a chair and force you to force you to play Professor Lane with us. I played the last one. What are you talking about? You kind of played the last one, and every time you play with us, you kind of stone out and seem uninterested. <laughs> It, That's it, it, because it, I got it. I was so under stress. Uh, it's okay. We understand. We understand. It's more of a joke, buddy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Man. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, I just. Oh. Yeah. We like it was you. a tight squeeze, but everything, everything's finally packed away. <laughs> Marcus, Marcus brought a whole bunch of fun to. Uh... Uh, Congress bad for a date. Yeah, he did. I do. Uh, I do. I do like to try to uh, do call last when I can and such. A bit of planning will prevent this type of scrabbling in the near future. Oh, 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 sorry. Uh, you're fine. <clears throat> you're right, and I do feel better with everything put away. Come on, Professor, let's look around for some more. Okay, but guess what, Luke? God Another damn it! Puzzle. 
Oh, ew, Professor, the sugar is covered with fucking ants. Oh dear, <laughs> I'll have to remember to get the sugar for my tea elsewhere. God damn it, he fell for it. <laughs> Hi, Bunny. Curious, though, isn't it? How did they get here? Perhaps this puzzle will shed that? some light on things. No, you ready for this? What? Hi, Bonnie, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah, uh, you, you, ju you just now uh, got what his username was? <laughs> yes! <laughs> and, I, and I thought I was slow. <laughs> Anyway, all right, so <laughs> I retired right, from that so game series. Puzzle, by the way, um, I've, so I've, I've, already, I've already retired from that series. You know, it's, it's already, uh, the, it's already, it already got you. So I think, I think after sister location, the game went downhill. Game I went see. Downhill. <laughs> anyway, so for this puzzle, um, a, a, a busy work works tirelessly. Uh, one day, uh, he bumped into an ant while returning, uh, while returning to his nest with some food. Whoa, doofus! Don't you know you took the longest path possible back to the nest? Think about where you're going, man. Knowing the ant can never tra uh, the ant never travels at the same area twice. Uh, can you trace the path he walks I in know. the nest? I know. Go ahead. Try it out. All right. Uh, if you want to, sometimes uh, what works for me is that I work backwards with this. But all right, let's see what you got. So he can never travel the same area twice. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Got and it. There you go. Yep, that's it. Hey, nice. That was almost too easy. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go. You've got him, my boy. While I'm no fan of ants and my sugar, you have to admire their craftiness and work e work ethic. Maybe they're working so hard, maybe because even the sugar on the monetary is present is too fancy. Can you imagine if there was a fucking bullet ant there? Oh my fucking god. I mean, it's not, it's not that, um, it's not that uh, possible. I know I accidentally skipped the text, so... Blah blah blah, I said something. Blah blah blah, I said something. I was going to murder you with ants, but you found out my plan. Anyway. Remember, Luke, we're here to find the Elysium box, so don't get sidetracked it. You don't have to tell me that twice. I can relate to that. <laughs> now, 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 why don't we start our search by investigating the train? Alrighty. Oh, Professor? Professor, can we... The profess can we professor also, um... decide to explore the Monetary Express. Alright, uh, let's see if I remember where... Oh, the professor, professor, can we... Do you have some cocaine I can snort? Uh, sorry, Luke. This isn't that kind of... Uh, this isn't got... This isn't that kind of extra fancy train. Oh, but don't worry, we will be on drugs. We will be on drugs for this game, trust me. Uh, I'll be the little girl. I hear the rooms in the I hear the rooms in the front of the train are so are so super fancy that the doorknobs are made of gold. No one's allowed inside except for really rich people. So, misters, are you really rich? Because if you are, you can go see the super duper fancy rooms. Uh, the kind of game, uh, the kind of games I usually play on the gaming channel, um, I usually play any type of games, really. Was, uh, so far, I've been mostly playing, uh, oh, platformers, point-and-click, as well as, um, as well as a couple of RPGs as well. I think she was referring to me, or maybe she was referring to you, not so sure. I think, uh, I think, I think it might be for all of us, anyway. Anyway. Luke? Oh. <laughs> Super! Super D, duper. Super D duper fancy rooms. Oh boy, oh boy. Barney, get eh? the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> but not, but none but the extremely wealthy can enter. If our young miss is correctly informed, there must be a set of deluxe rooms in the, in the next car. Wow, I sure, I sure like to see those. I bet they're utterly fantastic. Puzzle. I mean, fucking I'm going to my grandma's. Where are you two going? We're actually out looking for something, dear. Sadly, we don't know where it is. Until we find a clue to point us in the right direction, we'll simply have to we'll have to continue looking. Oh, that sounds like lots of work. 
Here, I'll tell you a puzzle to take your mind off that stuff. Alright, a strip of paper. After trying to fold a strip of paper in half, you notice that one side of the folded strip is one inch longer than the other. Determined to get it right, you fold the strip again, only to discover that only to discover that now the other end of the fold strip is an inch longer than the other. Now that you've made two folds along your strip, figure out what the distance between the two folds is when express when expressed in tenths of an inch. Uh, yeah, another new feature. Uh, basically, for numbers and words, they added uh, extra col uh, columns as well too for you to write your numbers and words. All right, I know this one. Uh, what do you think? Let me let me. Let me take a look. First, let me read. Let me read quietly, and then I'll tell you. Okay. All right, let's take a yeah, look. Uh, yeah, 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 uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stars, same here. I, I sometimes don't do well with anything horror. Uh, I don't do well with anything horror related in general. Well, uh, let me let me say, tell something to Star since she's listening. Um, I am a retired FNAF uh, master. I'm a. I say retired because I I retired after the the how's it was called the pizzeria simulator game. That one was fucking terrible. I retired after that game, and I decided, you know what? After this game, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go retire because I don't. I don't care about the series anymore. Because now, now they're starting to focus on the VR, and I'm. I'm more. I'm very upset that you know that that you know they didn't end it. I was. I was actually looking forward for them to end the series, but now there's. It, it's gotten to a point where now it's like so repetitive and so annoying that I decided, you know what? I don't care about the nap anymore. Yeah. All right. So. All right, so, so anyway. All right. So. 10. 10? Alright. Alright. One in the middle, and okay, Ten. there we go. Yep. This should be and you're right. I missed that. I, uh, I had a feeling. Uh, ba uh, basically, the question was, was that basically uh, you folded a strip of paper and such, and you made one uh, one, uh, one side bigger than the, longer than the other, and basically, it was just basically asking, like, you know, uh, what's the distance between the uh, folds that you made in tenth of an inch? So yeah, and it also says right here, if you're having trouble if you're having trouble visualizing this, picture that the mass the matchbox shown above has a height than one inch. Imagine that imagine that the areas where one side of the box contain the top and bottom are folded in the strip. And you can see how and you can see how the extent length in both folds can be represented by the other side. You got it. Wow, those hats you're wearing must be thinking caps or something. I hope you find whatever it is you're looking for, misters. Alrighty. Let's go check out the deluxe room. I bet the deluxe room is make our room a, 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 look like a freight car. Oh, this is, I'll do this, Sammy Hagar. Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hold it right there, man. Sammy Hagar says entrance that the car is only for VIPs only, capiche? Now, I know you like to sneak a peek, but the whole car is booked, so that's a no-go. No-go. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah the thing about Sammy is that, like, he loves to rock and roll. Well, I think that, I think he's referencing Sammy Hagar. Um, uh, it, it's possible. <laughs> yeah, the, the, guy, the guy that joined Van Halen after David Lee Roth left. Anyway. <laughs> I bet I bet the kind of person who we can rent out the whole car must be some kind of super tycoon. <laughs> Indeed, uh, lady. I wonder what it must be like to have that much room to yourself on a train of this caliber. Well, for now, I suppose you'll you'll have to get you have to keep wondering, eh, Professor? <laughs> hmm. Well, fuck you too. Just made it more easier for me to kill you at night. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> yes, I suppose oh. accommodations will do. I do hope my darling boy will be pleased. That reminds me, I believe it's Disney time for my sweet baby. Dowager hat? Oh, the dining car! Uh, probably Dowager. Uh, ac uh actually, uh, it, it kind of does sound a little bit like Dowager hat. It does. Anyway. Gosh, that lady was just the type I expect to see on the Monetary Express. Talk about reaching fancy. Quite. 
The strain is full of many well-headed patreons like the woman we just met. We must watch our deeds and words here. A formal setting demands formal manners, wouldn't you say? Ah, oh, hold on. Okay. <laughs> uh, absolutely, Professor. Alright, uh... Uh, again, and again, just uh, just a reminder that, like, you know, um, I will try to get all the hint coins, but if there's some that where I literally don't know where they are, I'm just gonna skip them. Uh, so for those that want to see where all the hint coins are, check out the, uh, uh, just check out, you know, uh, the walkthrough I did on this game on uh, the gaming channel. Just look at the craftsmanship on this picture, Luke. I'm almost certain it was hand blown. Who knew that something as ordinary as a picture could be so fancy? What could be more relaxing than sitting in your suite with a cold beverage and watching the sunset? On oh, speaking of beverage, or in this case, deadly beverages, I have a puzzle for you. What do you take better, rat poisoning or bug poisoning? <laughs> Let me add the professor. All right. You're trying to say that it, you're trying to say that if I that if I drink rat poisoning, you're gonna fucking kill me? <laughs> Abby, uh, I, I mean, I mean, the inspector was on to me when he said, the inspector was on to me when he said I was trying to keep you around as an apprentice. I must destroy all the wind. I must destroy all the evidence, Luke. I, 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 I yeah, Star. Um, I definitely yeah, love. I definitely love this game's soundtrack. It's definitely above and beyond better than, um, um than Curious Village. Um, in fact, I might say this might be, uh, this might be even a little bit more better than Unwound Future. Uh, anyway, uh, did you read? Uh, did you? Uh, did you read the question, uh, Toy Bonnie, or did you want me to read it? Yes, I, 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 I've read it. Anyway, I was gonna say, Get the fuck out of here with that bullshit, Professor! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, since you read it, uh, what do you think? A or B? I think it's B. Alrighty. Hmm, let's see if this and works. it's B. I'm on fire with the freaking puzzles again! I don't know why! I mean, I mean, some of them are pretty easy, but uh, uh, but to be fair, uh, we might get one, we might get to, uh, we might get to those puzzles where even you might struggle a little bit. So we'll just wait and yeah. see. All right. Excellent work. Now let's press on. We must stand around all day. All right, let's go. All right, let's see. Pin coin. Uh. Hey, Justin, I want you to I'm voice hurt. someone. You haven't voiced anyone in a while. <laughs> oh, you little... Mm. Um. I'm dreadfully sorry, sir, but I'm afraid all the seats in our fine establishment are taken right now. What a pity. Indeed, it is, sir. But, while you wait for a table, May I interest you in a, how you say, puzzle? <laughs> Alrighty. Dining couples. Four couples sit elbow to elbow in a crowded dining car. All diners are sitting next to, sitting next to or across from their partners. Uh, the Joneses are sitting by the aisles. The mustachio Mr. O'Connor sits beside his wife. Mr. Lambert sits across from his wife. Using the information above, can you determine where Miss, uh, where Mrs. H uh, Hanley is sitting? I know. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, let's uh, let's have Justin try first. He hasn't had uh, he hasn't had an answer. Yeah, puzzle. Justin, go ahead. Joneses go ahead, are go ahead, sitting go ahead. by the aisle. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So that's B F G C. The mustache Mr. O'Connor sits beside his wife. So okay, there's. Okay. So that's B and A. Mm hmm Okay. Mr. O'Connor is not a Jonas. So therefore, it's a C, F, or G for the, uh, for the, uh, for the Jonases. Mr. Lambert sits across from his wife. Okay, so who's sitting across from their wife? Okay, that would be C, G, or H, D. Using the information above, can you determine where Miss Headley is sitting? Circle her and submit. It's A. Do you think it's A? A or E. Alrighty, what do you think, Toy Bonnie? I say it's E. You say E? Alright. 
Which are we gonna try first? Yes. Uh -huh, you're both right. All right. Huh. Wonderful. You still yeah, I, didn't, I didn't know it's which. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't know which which uh you which one you picked first before you hit the submit button. That's why. That's fine. 